evening everybody. Hi Janice, really pleased you're still watching, sending lots of love and hoping that you're up and at them soon. Hi Barbara and Margaret, hope we've all had a really terrific Tuesday. Mine was slightly better than Monday. Evening Wendy, glad you could join us. Anyway, my Tuesday was a little bit better than my Monday. And as always, nice to see you all. I suffered last night with noise from the kids and when I listened to it today, I couldn't actually hear the noise on the recording. So apologies for the um, in and out and the stopping and yesterday because you couldn't hear anything whilst I was deafened by the noise of the cartoon. No, it would transpire nothing picked up on the recording. So that's good. Thanks for coming back today. I'll just turn us round and we'll start as we mean to go on. The eternal God is your refuge and underneath are the everlasting arms. The Lord Almighty grant us a quiet night and a perfect end. Amen. Our help is in the name of the Lord who made heaven and earth. Let us pause and reflect on the sort of day that we've had. Save us, O Lord, while waking, and guard us while sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep may rest in peace. Whoever dwells in the shelter of the Most High, and abides under the shadow of the Almighty, shall say to the Lord, My refuge and my stronghold, my God, in whom I put my trust, for he shall deliver you from the snare of the fowler and from the deadly pestilence. He shall cover you with his wings and you shall be safe under his feathers. His faithfulness shall be your shield and buckler. You shall not be afraid of any terror by night, nor of the arrow that flies by day, of the pestilence that stalks in darkness, nor of the sickness that destroys in noonday. Though a thousand fall at your side and 10,000 at your right hand, yet it shall not come near you. Your eyes have only to behold to see the reward of the wicked. Because you have made the Lord your refuge and the Most High your stronghold, there shall no evil happen to you neither shall any plague come near your tent. For he shall give his angels charge over you to keep you in all your ways. They shall bear you in their hands lest you dash your foot against a stone. You shall tread upon the lion and adder. The young lion and the serpent you shall trample underfoot. Because they have set their love upon me, therefore will I deliver them. I will lift them up because they know my name. They will call upon me and I will answer them. I am with them in trouble. I will deliver them and bring them to honor. With long life will I satisfy them and show them my salvation. Glory to the Father, to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now and shall be forever. Amen. Jesus said, Come to me, all you that are weary and are carrying heavy burdens, and I will give you rest. Take my yoke upon you and learn from me, for I am gentle and humble in heart 
and you will find rest for your souls. For my yoke is easy, and my burden is light. Merciful God, we entrust to your unfailing and tender care this night those who are ill or in pain, knowing that whenever danger threatens, your everlasting arms are there to hold us safe, comfort and heal them, and restore them to health and strength. Through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. Be present, O merciful God, and protect us through the silent hours of this night, so that we who are wearied by the changes and chances of this fleeting world may rest upon your eternal changelessness. Through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. Visit this place, O Lord, we pray, and drive far from it the snares of the enemy. May your holy angels dwell with us in peace, and may your blessing be always upon us. Through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. I share with you today's prayer for the day. Holy God, faithful and unchanging, enlarge our minds with the true knowledge of your truth and draw us more deeply into the mystery of your love that we may truly worship you, Father, Son and Holy Spirit, one God, now and forever. Amen. And as our Father taught us, so let us pray together. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. In peace we will lie down and sleep. For you alone, Lord, make us dwell in safety. The Lord bless us and watch over us. The Lord make his face to shine upon us and be gracious to us. The Lord look kindly upon us and give us peace. Amen. Thank you for joining us as always and thank you for staying with me when I had to disappear into the other room and then there was an accident and Ralph came in so we had to hide the music while we ascertained what went wrong and then we came back. Thanks as always as I say for joining us, for keeping with it and please if there's anything at, anything at all that you want us to pray for or even if you just want to talk and you know where we are. 
send us a message. We can pray together or we can pray privately. <laughs> Good evening. See you tomorrow.